All right, we're back. Now it's time for the serious stuff. We're going to do in go into a basic throat return, followed by the hand change, followed by the bridges. But we're going to do it step by step, so don't panic. Let's go back to a basic closed hold. We're going to complete one basic step, which was one, two, back step. And then we're going to lead out in a basic throw and turn. But before we do the timing with that, we're just going to make sure that we have the direction of turn right and how to lead it. On count one, the guy lifts the hand up and the lady walks out under the arm. Lower the hand, bring the lady back under the arm, in the front position, and then back into a closed hold. We'll just do that one more, no timing yet. Raise the left hand, lady walks out under the arm, walks back under the arm, and then back into a closed hold. Okay, so to put that together with the timing, we do one basic step, one, two, back step. As we step through on the one, the left hand comes up, lady responds, walking out on step two, lower the hand into a back step. Okay, we'll just do that again for you. Starting off with the one, two, back step, and one, two, back step, step out, two, and back step. And now all you've got to do is draw the lady back under the arm with another one, two, back step. We step one, two, back step. And then we draw the lady into a closed hold with yet another one, two, back step. Okay, let's just moving along. There's just one little thing on the return that we need to do. We'll just uh, go through the throat first. We step one, two, back step. Send the lady out two and stop there. To make it a little easy for the lady to come back under the arm, we're going to move off to the left like this. We step off of the left foot, turning slightly, bring the right foot round behind and then do a back step and then draw into a closed hold. One, two, back step. Okay, so we'll just try that again. Here we go from the top and one, two, back step, out, two, back step, return, two, back step and close two, back step, and one time from this position, oh, one, two, back step, out, two, back step, return, two, back step, and close, two, back step. Okay, okay so once you've got that basic throat return going, it's then time for your first move, which is going to be the walkthroughs. To get into that position or to learn any of the moves, we need to stay in front position or open position. So here we go with the basic first, ready, and oh, one, two, back step, out, two, back step, return, two, and we'll just stop there. Okay, so now we're moving on along to all the fancy moves that go along with this. The first one we're going to do is a walk through the same hand or a change of place. The basis of this is, obviously, is change place. So we just walk through the other side and there we go, is the change of place. So the guy is turning all the way around to the left. The lady is just popping the hand around the waist and just walking around and picking up the free hand on the other side. Okay, so to put the timing into that, we're going to start with a back step first. We do a back step. You draw the lady in and both step forward, and this time the right hand comes over the top, stepping on the left foot to get out of the way. Hand around the waist, step on your two, and turn and face and back step. And there's your work first walkthrough done. Okay, so we'll do that again, starting from back step, here we go, and back step, step forward one, two, and back step. Okay, so that's the first one done. Now we want to walk through to a shake hand hold. So we call this one an open hand hold. When we walk through this next time, we're going to switch to a shake hand hold. So bring the feet together and start from a back step, here we go, back step, through to a shake hand, back step. Okay, so now you have two moves. And we'll do them again. Open position, walk through the same hand, back step, through to same hand, back step, through to a shake hand, back step. Okay, we'll just do that one last time. From an open position and back step, through to the same hand, through to a shake hand, and there we go. Okay, now the most difficult part of this one is coming up. It's an over the head behind the back hand change and it's all done on two counts. The first thing we're going to do is draw the right hand through, lifting it over the lady's head, and then bring it down behind your own, own back, switching hands behind your back, and then turning to face your partner. We'll just do that one more time from this side. Draw the lady forward, taking the right hand over the head. Guys turn to the left, hand chains behind the back, and turn to face your partner. Okay, the timing for that, starting from a rock step, is 
rock step, step one, change, and back step, and again from the side, and it's back step, or one, two, back step. Now to complete this sequence, or to complete the walkthroughs, we have to bring the lady back to front position, and the other thing we have to do is fix the handhold, because the hand has gone to the bottom. To fix the handhold, we just do a return under the arm, the same as what you did in the basics, bring the lady back under the arm, eye stepping to the left, two, and back step, and then the hand is back to the top. And then we come into a closed hold. A one, two, back step. So we might just do that over the head again. We, the hand, the hand, lady has a hand at the bottom. We just do the back step, looking at the lady, bringing the hand under, stepping off to the left, back step, and into a closed hold, and back step. Okay, so we'll start from the top of the basic throat return to the walkthroughs. Here we go, and step one, two, back step, step out, two, the return's coming up, a one, two, walk through the same hand, a one, two, we go through to a shake hand, over the head behind the back, and a return, and back into your closed hold. All right, I think we might try that to music. Okay, so here we are, now ready to try to music. So you take your closed hold, hand on behind the back, and ready to lead the lady. Five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, send the lady out. A one, two, and return. Walk through same hand. Through to a shake hand. Over the head behind the back. And return. And back into your closed hold. And we'll stop there. Okay, now we're going to see if we can't put two or three together. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, send the lady out. And return. Walk through, same hand. Through to a shake hand. Over here, behind the back. And return. Back in the enclosed hold. Send the lady out. And return. Walk through, same hand, through door shake hand, over there behind the back, and return, and back in all closed hold. Alright, if you've mastered that, then I think you're ready for your next move. So we'll just switch the music off and we'll be right back. Okay, now we're really moving along. It's time for the next move, and the next move is going to be the hand change. We're actually going to join that on at the end of the walkthroughs. But for the moment, we might just start it from an open position, so we'll take an open hand hold. Before we do it step by step, we'll just show you what the move looks like. We go back step, a one, two, back step, one, two, back step, one, two, and just finish the top turn to finish, and then you return. Okay, so a good way to practice this is just start from an open position without holding your partner. And we're going to start off with the back step first. There we go, back step. First count is directly towards your partner. Step forward, one. Then we step to the side, small step to the side, and we do our normal back step. Now we're going to do it in reverse, or retrace our steps and first count is to the side. Then we take the big foot behind on count two, and do a back step. Okay, we'll do that again. We step forward, one. Side two, back step. Side one, behind two, back step. We'll keep going in so we can't pick up the rhythm. Okay, back step forward, side, back step, side, behind, back step forward, side, back step, side, behind, back step. We just might turn our back, and, uh, obviously that's not, not, not the way we're going to dance it, but you might follow the steps a little easier. From a back step, back step, step forward one, side two, back step, side, behind, Back step, forward, side, back step, side, behind, back step, forward, side, and back step. Alright, so if you've got that, it's now time to hold your partner and so we can't put it together. The first thing you're going to do when you get the lady in front position and you want to let her know you're doing the hand change is just offer the right hand. And so it works like this. Back step, offer the hand, the lady steps in on one, takes the hand, Step the side, release the front hand or the left to right hand hold, and do your back step. Okay, so we'll just try that again. Make sure that you always keep at least one hand hold here. So we go back step, pick up, and release. 
a back step. And we sort of hold the hand there so it's just about ready to pick up again. Let the lady step in as we step to the side. Take two. And back step. Alright, let's put that together. From a back step ready and present the hand. One, two, back step. One, two, and we'll keep going this time. And a one, two, back step. Well, I guess the easy part about this is that we're only doing three of them. So let's try it. Here we go. And back step. For one, two, back step. One, two, back step. One, two, back step. Okay, we'll do that one more time and we'll show you how to finish it. Here we go. And back step. For one, two, back step. One, two, back step. One. That's the last one. Okay, if we want to finish this now, as we step to the side one, the guy rise, raises the left hand nice and high, just above the lady's right shoulder. That's count one. The lady responds by taking the hand, and then the lady turns out under the arm, two, and back step. Now that's a familiar position, because that's the same position as they throw out. And now we need to bring the lady back under the arm to fix the hand hold. Guy stepping off to the left, and step one, two, back step. Now we'll just go through the finish there one more time. We're in a back step. We're just about to finish the hand change. We step side one, take the hand, turn under two, back step, back under the arm, one, two, back step. Okay, so let's put that together. We have three hand changes finished with a top turn. Ready, and back step for one, two, back step, one, two, back step, one, two, and top turn to finish, one, two, back step, return, two, back step. Okay, one more time from an open position. Ready, and back step for one, two, back step, one, two, back step, one, two, and top turn to finish, and a return. And for the moment, we'll come back into a closed hold. A one, two, back step. Okay, now the idea now is to add this on to your first set of steps, which was the basic throat return and the walkthroughs. So let's try from the top a closed hold, starting with the basic, ready, and a one, two, back step, send the lady out. The return, walk through same hand, lead low into the waist, lead low through to a shake hand hold, over the head behind the back, return, Face your partner, pop the hand out for the hand change. One, two, back step. One, two, back step. One, two, and finish with a top turn. Two, back step, return. Two, back step, and close. Two, back step. Now you could practice that move on its own if you didn't want to join it onto the walkthroughs, and there it would look like this. Ready, and a one, two, back step, send the lady out. Return, pop the hand out for your hand change, a one, two, back step, one, two, back step, one, two, and finish, one, two, back step, return, two, back step, close, two, back step. Well, it's time to practice the music again, so we're just going to pop off to the side, turn the music on, we'll be right back. Okay, so here we go, let's put the music from the top. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. And return. Walk through, same hand, lead low, in left waist. Lead low again, shake and hold, over the head behind the back. And a return. Hand change, pop that hand out, there's your lead. Second one, last one coming up. Pop the hand up, nice and high, above the lady's shoulder. Turn out, and return and back into your closed hold. Okay, now for those that want to practice the hand change on the right own, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out, and return. Pop that hand out for the hand change. One, two, back step, one, two, back step, one, two, and finish. And return. And back in your closed hold. And for those who want to put it all together, there's one for you again. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return. Walk through, same hand, lead nice and low. Through to a shake hand hold. Over the 
steady him on the back. And return. And change. One, two, back step. One, two, back step. One, two. And top turn to finish. And return. And back in the opposed hold. Alright, so you're putting that together, you're doing very well. But we're just going to take a little rest and we'll be back right back with the bridges. Alright, now when we're really moving along, it's time for the next move, which is going to be the bridges. Uh, we're going to start off in an open position again, because as I said before, uh, any of the different moves that you're going to do now start from an open position. We're going to do the bridges, and this is very similar to the change of place, except instead of leading low and walking through the other side, we're now going to lift the hand up and we're going to change place by walking under the, under the arm. So without any, actually what we'll do first is we'll show you the move, all four bridges, and then we'll just slowly walk through them. So look like this, we go back, step, for one, two, back, step, one, take two hands, turn the lady left on the left hand, pop the left hand up, and the lady turns left again. Okay, that look a bit complicated? Never mind, we're going to go through it nice and slowly for you. Start with the open position, without any timing whatsoever, just walk through the other side, we lift the hand up, Draw the lady forward and we just move through to the other side. Take as many steps as you want for the moment and there you go, there's one bridge done. We do two of those so we'll do it again. We walk through to the other side, at the end of the second one we reach out and we take a two hand hold. Okay, so we'll try that one more time, just leading in, left hand up, drawing the lady forward, walk under, turn to the left, draw the lady forward again, reach out and take your two hands. Now it's time to put the timing, and as usual, we'll start with a back step first, and it's just back step, one, two, back step, through to the other side, and here we go. Ready, and back step, step one, two, back step, one, two, and take your two hands. Looking good, let's do that again. Five, six, seven, eight, back step, ball one, two, back step, reach out, take two hands, and back step, looking good. Now for the second two moves. Uh, these are a little bit harder. You're going to keep in mind that this is a left turn for the lady. Now the, you've already done the left turn. We'll just go back to the basic. If you do a basic throw out, there's a right turn as the lady's walking out. But this is a left turn where we bring the hand over the lady's head. That's the left turn. So what we're doing for a double hand hold is again leading the left turn. But this time we're changing places. So the guy's got to make, big, make a big effort to step through on the left and get through the other side as he's drawing the lady under the left hand. So the left hand over the lady's head and we're just going to shuffle through to the other side there for a sec. Don't worry about the timing. You notice I'm led on the wrong foot but we're not doing the footwork yet. Okay, so again, you lead with that left hand, draw the lady through to the other side and just for the moment we'll pick up two hands. Okay, before we go too far, let's do the footwork now. So first of all, we start with a back step. We draw the lady forward. We need to step through with a left foot, right through to the other side. And now all we have to do is release the right hand, bring the right foot around behind, and go into a back step. Okay, so here we go from this side. Remember to lead with that left hand over the lady's head, stepping forward with the left foot, ready, and back step. Step left, two, and back step. Now before we move too much further, as you're turning to face your partner, the last one, we need to release the left hand. And as you release the left hand, you're going to pop it up in front of your right shoulder and just look at your watch as if you're checking the time. Okay, so we'll show you what that looks like. We go back, step, one, two, and check the time. Okay, so here we go. Ready, and back, step, one, two, and back, step. Okay, so we might just do that from the top, walking under, under the arm first. Ready, and back step, walk under. Two, back step, walk under, reach out, take two hands, and turn the lady left on the left. Remember to reach out, release that left hand before the back step, hands up in front of your right shoulder. Well, now the lady sees that hand and she's going to complete one more left turn. The lady will step in and take that. The footwork is exactly the same. Step through on that left foot. Release the right hand, we don't want that anymore. Turn and face your partner to, and back step. We'll just do that for you from this side. Left hand's up in front of the shoulder, just like you're looking at your watch. Left hand in front of your right shoulder. Lady steps in, step through on the left foot, two, and back step. And from this point we come back into a closed hold. One, two, 
back step. Okay, so that's the four bridges. The important things about the bridges, make sure you change places all four times. Here we go. Walk under the arm, turning to the left guys, change place. Walk under again, take your two hands, turn the load your left under the left hand, pop that left hand up, and there we go, and back into a closed hold. Okay, now for those that want to practice this particular move from a closed hold, we can start and do a basic throw and return first, and then walk into the bridges. Here we go, ready, and a one, two, back, step, step out, two, back, step, return, two, now walking under, a one, two, walk under again, one, two, take your two hands, turn the leg left on the left, left on the left again, and then back and not closed hold. Well, the good news is that we're ready to try that to music, so we'll just wander off again, get that music going, and we'll be right back. Okay, so here we go to the music, we're just going to do the basic front return first, and into the bridges. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out, and return. Now here we go, nice one, then walking under guys, one, two, walk under again, one, take your two hands, turn the lady left, pop that hand up, and back in my close hold. Well, how did you go? That was a tough one, so we just might do that again. Five, six, seven, eight. Send the lady out, return. Now walk under, draw the lady forward, just walk under and turn left, walk under, two hands, and pop that left hand up, and there you go, back into a post hold. Right now, for the hot dogs, I reckon they have all this, here we go, right from the very top. Five, six, seven, eight, the basic. Send the lady out. Return. Walk through, down to the waist. Through to a shake hand hold. Over the head behind the back. And a return. Pop that hand out. There's the lead. Two. Back step. One. Two. Back step. One. Two. Send the lady out. And return. Now it's bridges. Under we go. A one. Two. Back step. One. Two. Turn the lady left under left. Left under left again. And back into your closed hold. Alright, let's do it one more time. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return. Walk through, same hand, down to the waist, run that hand round the waist, pick up the hand, through a shake hand, over the head, in the hand change, and a one, two, back step, one, two, back step, one, two, pop the hand up and finish. And return, in the bridges, under we go. And a one, two, back step, one, two hands. Pop the hand up, back into your closed hold. And there you go. Okay, if you haven't got that, well I guess you can always rewind the tape and keep working on it. We'll be back shortly. Alright, welcome back. It's time for the next session and you've seen what's ahead of you, but we might just show you first. Okay, so we'll just run through the whole routine and then we're going to break it down for you. So here we go. We go one, two, we send the lady out. We do the return, pick up two hands, we're going to do a couple of walk arounds. And pull the lady into a side cuddle, tuck turn out, pull the lady straight back into a closed hold. Tuck turn out again, change of place to a shake hand hold, top turn into side by side, and we're going to finish with a shoulder promenade or shoulder drapes. Shake hand hold, over the head behind the back, and a return, and then back into your closed hold. Well that might look like a lot to do, but we're going to do it nice and slowly for you. The first thing we do is a basic throat return and pick up two hands. We know the basics, so here we go. Ready, and a one, two, back step, send the lady out, and return, and pick up two hands before you do your back step. Okay, so here we go. Two hands. Now we're going to walk around. It's really quite easy because all you're going to do is draw the lady forward, and she's going to step on the right foot directly towards you, and we're just going to step to the side and wheel the lady around. So we'll do the back step first. 
We draw the lady forward, step forward, they step forward on the right foot, we step around on the left. We bring the right foot around, count two, and we do the back step. So the guys, again, we step the side left. Right foot around behind two, and back step. And while we're here, we'll just go through Chris's steps, or maybe even Chris might even go through the steps for you, which does back step first. Go forward. Forward on the right foot. To the side. On the left foot. And then back step. And back step. Okay? We'll do that one again for Chris, so we just back step first. On to the... Forward on your right. On the right. Side, side left. And back, back step. step. I thought she'd lost her voice for a minute. Never mind. So here we go again. Let's do it together. Ready and back step. Side two. That's the guy steps. Step forward, girls. To the side. side and back step. And one. Forward, side, back step. Forward, side, back step. Forward. Back. And the guys, side. they step side behind. Back step, side behind. Back step. One, two, back step. Now you might want to know what to do with the arms, obviously they're obviously going to get in the way, so we just lower the left hand and just stick the right hand up a bit, that's the easiest way to get them out of the way. So as we draw the lady forward, we just spread the hand slightly and then just move around the clockwise direction. Okay, so the easy part about this is that we're only going to do two. So here we go, back step first, ready, and a back step for one, two, back step, one, two, back step. Okay, so let's do that from the top, first hold. Are you ready? Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up your two hands, two walk arounds, and or one, two, back step, one, two, and back step, that's the two. The next move, we're going to be a little while before we get to put this to music because we're going to go through the whole routine. Bring the feet together just for the moment. We're going to do a cuddle. We all should know what a cuddle is. We just draw the left hand over the lady's head and pull her straight into our right shoulder, locking the left hand to the front, and that's a cuddle. Okay, we'll just do that again. We haven't done the timing yet. We've got a double hand hold. Just draw the lady forward, left hand over the lady's head, and into cuddle. The lady actually comes in under the left hand and goes out under the left. So when we want to send her out again, we lift the left hand up and send her out to the left hand, under the left hand. So we did it again, in under the left hand, and then back out under the left. Okay, so we'll do that from a rock step, and we'll put the timing. Obviously we do rock step first, and we get the lady to step forward, and bring her to the side, cuddle on the second count, and then we do a rock step while we're in side by side. Here we go. Rock step, one, two, a rock step. Now we bring the lady into what we call forward tuck position. That means we're going to step forward on that right foot, holding her reasonably firm, raising the left hand up. That's count one. And making a pivot straight out into front position, count two, two, and back step. Okay, that's looking good. So here we go from the top of the cuddle, that is. Ready, and back step. By one, two, back step. One, two, Back step. Okay, and remember it's in on the left, out on the left. One more time. Ready and back step. Oh, one, two, back step. One, two, back step. Okay, so let's put that together. Back to close to hold, basic throw return. Two hands, two walk arounds, and then the cuddle. Close to hold. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, one, two, back steps. And the lady out. Two, back step. Return the two hands. Two walk arounds and a one, two, back step, one, cuddle time and a one, two, back steps and a out, two, back step. Well done. Next move is very, very easy. We're just going to draw the ladies for straight into a closed hold. So we just pull straight into a closed hold, two, into a back step and send the lady out with a tuck turn under the left hand. Okay, so again, we pull the lady forward into a closed hold, two counts, into the back step, forward tuck on one, and turn out two, and back step. Okay, here we go guys, let's do the timing. Back step first, ready, and back step, or one, two, back step, tuck, and turn, and back step. One more time, from a back step, ready, and back step, or one, two, Back step, tuck and turn and back step. Okay, so here we go from the very beginning again. So we're back to a closed hold. 
five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, back step, send the lady out, return, pick up two hands, two walk arounds, and a one, two, back step, one, two, left hand over cuddle, or one, two, back step, send the lady out, straight back into your closed hold, send the lady out, and there you go, back to open position. All right, one more time. Let's keep it together. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. And a return. Pick up your two hands nice and early. Two walk arounds. One, two, back step. One, two, left hand over cuddle. Or one, two, back step. Send the lady out. Straight back in the closed hold. Send the lady out. And there we go. Time for the next move. Now the next move is easy because it's a move that you've done in the very first sequence. It's just a the very first step. It's just a change of place to a shake hand hold. A change of place to a shake hand hold. So we walk through to the other side, right hand over the top, turn and face your partner and pick up a shake hand hold. Okay, we'll do that one more time from this side. With this, this time of the time, we back step first. Ready, back step, lift that right hand over the top, turn around the face and shake hand hold. Now what we're going to do now is go over the head with the hand chains behind the back and come back into a closed hold. Again, this is something you've done from the first set. So it's over the head, hand chains behind the back, bring the lady back under the arm to front position and then back into a closed hold. Okay, we'll just do that one more time again for a shake hand hold. Do your back step first, draw the lady in, right hand over the lady's head, hand chains behind the back, do your rock step, back under the arm, one, two, back step and back into your closed hold. Right, I know we've got two more moves to go but I thought we'd just cut it off there from a shake hand hold over the head and then we'll come back and we'll put that together for you. So one time from the top before you try the music. Ready and one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up two hands, two walk arounds and a one, two, back step, one, two, left hand over cuddle, a one, two, back step, send the lady out, straight back into your closed hold, pull her straight in, send her out to the front, change your place to shake and hold, over the head behind the back, and a return, and back into your closed hold. Alright, it's time to try to music, and we'll be right back. Alright, so now we're ready to try to music, let's take your closed hold, frame up nicely, just a slightly open stance, and feel that music. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return, you got your two hands, two walk arounds. Left hand over cuddle. Send the lady out. Straight back into your closed hold. Send the lady out. Change your place to shake and hold. Over the head behind the back. And return, and back into your closed hold. One more time from this side, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up your two hands, hold nice and early, and around we go. Second one, left hand over for cuddle. Send the lady out. Straight back in the closed hold. Send the lady out. Change the place to shake and hold. And over the head. And a return. And back into your closed hold. Alright, we're going to leave you to practice that. And we're just going to move off. Come back shortly with another two steps. The next move. We are going to be a little while before we get to put this to music because we're going to go through the whole routine. Bring the feet together just for the moment. We're going to do a cuddle. We all should know what a cuddle is. We just draw the left hand over the lady's head and pull her straight into our right shoulder, locking the left hand to the front, and that's a cuddle. Okay, we'll just do that again. We haven't done the timing yet. We've got a double hand hold. Just draw the lady forward, left hand over the lady's head, and into cuddle. The lady actually comes in under the left hand and goes out under the left. So when we want to send her out again, we lift the left hand up and send her out to the left hand, under the left hand. So we did it again, in under the left hand, and then back out under the left. OK, 
Okay, so we'll do that from a rock step and we'll put the timing. Obviously we do rock step first and we get the lady to step forward and bring it aside, cut on the second count and then we do a rock step while we're in side by side. Here we go. Rock step, one, two, rock step. Now we bring the lady into what we call forward tuck position. That means we're going to step forward on that right foot, holding a reasonably firm, raising the left hand up, that's count one, and making a pivot straight out into front position, count two, two, and back step. Okay, that's looking good. So here we go from the top of the cuddle that is. Ready and back step. One, two, back step. One, two, back step. Okay, and remember it's in on the left, out on the left. One more time. Ready and back step. One, two, back step. One, two, back step. Okay, so let's put that together. Back to closed hole, basic throw return. Two hands, two walk arounds, and then the cuddle. Closed hold. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, back steps, and the lady out, two, back step, return the two hands, two walk arounds, and a one, two, back step, one, cuddle time, and a one, two, back steps, and they're out, two, back step. Well done. Next move is very, very easy. We're just going to draw the ladies for straight into a closed hold. So we just pull straight into a closed hold. Two, into a back step, and send the lady out with a tuck turn under the left hand. Okay, so again, we pull the lady forward into a closed hold, two counts, into the back step, forward tuck on one, and turn out two, and back step. Okay, right, here we go guys, let's do the timing. Back step first. Ready, and back step. Or one, two, back step, tuck and turn and back step. One more time. From a back step, ready, and a back step. Or one, two, back step, tuck and turn and back step. Okay, so here we go from the very beginning again. So we're back to a closed hold. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, back step. Send the lady out. Return, pick up two hands, two walk arounds, and a one, two, Back step, one, two, left hand over cuddle, or one, two, back step, send the lady out. Straight back into your closed hold, send the lady out, and there you go, back to open position. All right, one more time. Let's keep it together. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out, and a return. Pick up your two hands nice and early, two walk arounds, one, two, back step, one, two, left hand over cuddle, or one, two, back step, send the lady out, straight back in the closed hold, send the lady out, and there we go. Time for the next move. Now the next move is easy because it's a move that you've done in the very first sequence, it's just a the very first step, it's just a change of place to a shake hand hold. A change of place to a shake hand hold. So we walk through to the other side, right hand over the top, Turn and face your partner and pick up a shake hand hold. Okay, we'll do that one more time from this side. With this, this time of the timing, back step first. Ready, back step, lift that right hand over the top, turn around and face and shake hand hold. Now what we're going to do now is go over the head with the hand chains behind the back and come back into a closed hold. Again, this is something you've done from the first set. So it's over the head, hand chains behind the back, bring the lady back under the arm to front position and then back into a closed hold. Okay, we'll just do that one more time again for a shake hand hold. Do your back step first, draw the lady in, right hand over the lady's head, hand chains behind the back, do your rock step, back under the arm, one, two, back step, and back into your closed hold. Right, I know we've got two more moves to go, but I thought we'd just cut it off there from a shake hand hold over the head, and then we'll come back and we'll put that together for you. So, one time from the top before you try the music. Ready, and one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up two hands, two walk arounds, and a one, two, back step, one, two, left hand over cuddle, a one, two, back step, send the lady out, straight back into your closed hole, pull her straight in, send her out to the front, change your place to shake hand hold, over the hip behind the back, and a return, 
and back in the closed hole. Alright, it's time to try out to music and we'll be right back. Alright, so now we're ready to try out to music. Let's take your closed hold, frame up nicely, just a slightly open stance and feel that music. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return. Pick up your two hands, two walk arounds. The left hand over cuddle. Send the lady out. Straight back into your pose hold. Send the lady out. Change your pose to shake and hold. Over the head behind the back. And return. And back into your pose hold. One more time from this side. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, on one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up your two hands, hold nice and early, and around we go. Second one, left hand over for cuddle. Send the lady out. Straight back in the pose hold. Send the lady out. Change your face to shake and hold. And over the head, and the return. And back into your close fold. Alright, we're going to leave you to practice that and we're just going to move off. Come back shortly with another two steps. Okay, the last two steps to finish off this set. Now we're just going to back it up just a little and remember where we took a shake and hold. Or maybe we'll just take from an open hand hold just to remind you. We did the change of place to a shake and hold. But before we go over the head behind the back, we're going to add two more moves from this position. For the first time, we're going to get the lady to do a top turn. Right, now, top turn, actually, we'll show you the first two moves, and the top turn will look like this in the side by side. In the side by side, we're going to send the lady out, we end up with a double cross hand hold, and we're going to finish with a promenade. And then we finish with a shake and hold. Okay, so we need to explain this really slowly for you. We start off with a shake hand hold. We've got to encourage the lady to do a top turn or a right turn this time. Not a left turn, it's a right turn. So we do the rock set first. We draw the lady forward. We raise this hand above the lady's right shoulder. If you like, we're creating a window here that we can actually look under the arm and we can see the lady under the arm. There's the window. At the same time, we're offering the left hand. The lady's going to take that as she steps in on two. Okay, so we'll do that again. Careful to raise that hand on one and above the lady's right shoulder. The lady sees the hand here, now she's just going to, also we step forward on the left foot, let's count one, the lady pivots on her right foot and comes in the side by side and we just lower the hand here like so. Okay, we might just try that from this side and see if it looks any better for you. Here we go, we go back step, off of that hand and the lady steps in, right hand over the lady's head and we bring it up in a side by side position. Now to finish this off on count one, we bring the lady into a forward tuck position again. So with that right hand, we draw the lady through, stepping onto the right foot. And then we lift the left hand over the lady's head, turning her out under this left hand. And we keep both hands. So we step out two and back step. And we're left with a crossed hand hold, left hand hold at the top. All right, so let's do that. Starting with a shake hand hold, a top turn into side by side. Ready and back step. Step in one. Half turn, two, back step, out on the left, two, back step. Very good. Okay, we'll try that from this side. Remember, above the lady's right shoulder, create the window and offer the hand. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, back step in one, half turn, two, back step, out on the left, two, back step. Okay, to finish this off, we need to do the shoulder promenade or shoulder drapes. Now we need to go slowly so we're not going to worry about the footwork. We've got a left hand crossed hold here. We're going to draw the lady forward at the same time we're going to lift this left hand over our own head or start to lift it over our own head. We're watching the lady here and as the lady steps in we take the right hand over the lady's head and we end up in a shoulder promenade. Okay we'll just try that again. Make sure you keep watching your lady here. Shake hand hold and left hand to the top. Do your rock step first. Draw the lady forward. I might say at the moment the steps for this are exactly the same as the top turn in the side by side. The lady steps forward one. Here comes the hand over the head. That's one. But the hands on over, so I'm not in a rush for the hands. Over my own head on two. And there we go, into side by side. 
Okay, we'll just see if we can try that with flirt to my count, and you'll see that we're not in a rush with the hands, and they tend to come up over on the and count rather than the one and the two. So here we go, ready, and rock step. One and two, and a rock step. To finish this off, we just bring the lady in a forward, that forward tuck position, release the left hand, and turn the lady out with the right without taking it over the head, and you do a rock step. Okay, we'll just try that again. So you've got shake hand hold, left hand at the top. Shoulder promenade, ready, and a rock step. Step in one, over the head two. Rock step, release that left hand, turn the lady out with the right, and you end up with your start hand, which is your shake hand hold. So let's see if we can put those two moves together. The top turn into side by side, followed by the shoulder drapes or the promenade. Ready, and back step. Step in one, turn two. Back step and out, two, back step and one and two, back step and out, two. From here, we just go over the head with the hand chains behind the back. We've done this many times through the video. Over the head, hand chains behind the back, ladies out the side, back under the arm, and back into your closed hold. Okay, so one last time we'll walk through that from a shake and hold. Five, six, seven, eight. Top turn into side by side. Out we go into shoulder promenade and one and two. Back step out to over the head behind the back hand change. One, two, back step, return to back step and close to back step. Now if you're not too sure where that fits into the routine, we might just back it up to a cuddle. So we'll take a double hand hold. We do the cuddle first, left hand over in the cuddle, we send the lady out, we come straight back into a closed hold, send the lady out, a change of place to a shake hand hold, and here comes those last two moves, top turn into side by side, and we finish with a shoulder drape, and send the lady out to a shake hand hold, and over the head behind the back, and a return, and back in the closed hold. All right, let's see if we can do it from a closed hold and put all those moves together. From the top, closed hold, open out, relax. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up your two hands, two walk arounds, and a one, two, back step, one, two, in the cull, a one, two, Back step, send the lady out. Straight back into your closed hold. Send the lady out. Change your place to shake hand hold. Top turn side by side. Send the lady out. And followed by the promenade or shoulder drapes. So one and two. Back step out. Two and over the head behind the back. And a return. Back into your closed hold. And we'll just do that one more time before it tilts music. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up two hands, two walk arounds, and a one, two, back step, one, two, in the cuddle, a one, two, back step, send the lady out. Straight back in the closed hold, send the lady out. Change of place, shake and hold. Top turn side by side, off of that hand. And send the lady out. Shoulder drapes, a one, two, back step and out, two. And over the head behind the back. And a return. Back of the closed hold. And that's it, we're ready for music. We'll be right back. Okay, so here we go, the second routine to music. Close hold. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, send the lady out. Return, pick up your two hands, two walk arounds. Left hand over in the cuddle. Send the lady out. Straight back into your closed hold. Send the lady out. Change of place, shake hand hold. Top turn, see the hand, there it is. Send the lady out. Over your own head first. A one, two, back step out. Two, over there behind the back. And return. 
back in the enclosed hole, and we're ready to try it again. Five, six, seven, eight. Send the line here. Return. Pick up your two hands. Two walk arounds. Left hand over in the cuddle. Send the lady out. Close hold. Send the lady out. Change the place, shake and hold. Top turn, side by side. Send the lady out. Shoulder breaks. Hold one and two. Back step, one. Over there behind the backhand chain. And return. And back in the close hold. Okay, it's time to do all what to learn in this video. This is going to be one of the very beginning. Basic throw and turn in the walkthroughs. And change bridges and followed by the set we just did. Five, six, seven, eight, a basic. Send the lady out. Return. Walk through, same hand, leap right over the waist. Through to a shake hand. Over the head behind the back. And return. And change time. Oh, one, two, back step, one, two, back step, one. Top down and finish. That was the last one. Under the arm. Return. Now bridges walking under two times. That's one. That's two. Take the two hands nice and early. Left under left. Left under left again. Back into a close hold. Send the lady out. Return, pick up two hands, two walk arounds. Left hand over in the cuddle. Send the lady out. Close hold. Send the lady out. Change of place, shake and hold. Top turn, side by side. Send the lady out. And shoulder drags. Over there behind the back, and return, and back in the enclosed hold. Okay, well done. If you got through all of that, well then I guess you've passed the Fonzie Academy of Dancing. Congratulations. We're going to be right back in a few moments with some little tips that might help you out with your, with your style. Thank you. Okay, well I guess you've been out there practicing really hard. Well, we've just got a few things, hopefully, that will just make things a little easier and hopefully make you enjoy it and relax a little. Just remember the basic steps that we did from the very beginning. What I'm trying to do now is just relax those knees slightly, okay? And get your body weight forward. Body weight forward. No upper bottom. We don't want any bounce in our upper body. We just want to do this smoothly from the hips down. So if you relax, those knees are relaxed, the hips tend to work. So we'll just do a little practice step from the, uh, doing the basic steps, keeping our knees nice and relaxed. Ready, and or one, two, back step, one, two, back step. Now if your steps are nice and small, if the music gets really fast, you obviously can't do big steps, so you keep the steps nice and small, nice and tidy. Now a little thing with the back step. Now a back step is taking what they call a third position, which is a, looks like this. The back foot is just slightly angled to the front foot, and that's what they call third position. Now that is an ideal position for your back step. We don't want to hook it around too far behind, and we don't want to go back there, we might step on somebody, we just want to keep them nice and tidy. And as we do the back step, we also do not take all our body weight back and then forward. We just push this foot in the floor so it's back step, a nice quick back step. Okay, so let's try that. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, back step, one. Two. So you notice on the back step we're not moving away. The body weight is still forward. Two. Back step. Okay. When we're in closed hold, we want to frame up here slightly. We've got to attack this move with a little bit of confidence. We have to hold our partner like so. And I know we get nervous, we're beginners, we don't know our partner very well, and sometimes we tend to hold our partner a little bit like this without any connection whatsoever. A little bit of confidence. Lock the lady in this right hand so she can't get away. And if you're connecting with a partner there, well then she can feel the rhythm because we are leaders and we're trying to lead the lady in this one-two rock step. So with our upper body, there's a slight subtle movement as we go one, two, and then we just push a little with that left hand, pushing the lady into rock steps because we're the ones that are encouraging her to go with us in the rhythm. One, two, a rock step. One, two, a rock step. 
Okay, now the worst thing you can do there is look after yourself, guys, and make a move that looks like this. One, two, rock step. One, two, rock step. Okay, so you've got to look after your partner. Push her into that rock step very subtly. Ready? And one, two, rock step. One, two, rock step. Now concerning the basic throw at return, the lead on this actually comes out of the back step rather than the one. Now I know we did the beginning of the tape, we said one, two, rock step and the hand comes up on the one. By now you should have started to relax a little and the lead will actually come out of it on the rock step. So we'll just do a couple of basics and you'll see how I lead a little bit stronger on that back step and come up on the one. So see if you can follow this. We'll do a two or three and then I'll lead it out. Ready and a one, two, see that? It's quite relaxed, just a subtle lead here at the moment. But when I'm ready to go, I'll go back step and one, two, back step. Okay, we'll just show you the other one more time. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, back step. And here we go. We'll push slightly back a little bit more and up and two and back step. Okay, now another thing with the throat return, or any time the lady turns under the arm, it's a little rule that's been around since 1927, so in 70 odd years we really don't want to change it. We always let the lady walk out under the arm. We never take the hand over the lady's head. Okay, this is taking the hand over the lady's head. Okay, what we really want to do is allow the lady just to walk out on the arm. So there's the lead, we let the lady walk out and lower the hand. It's the same with it when we're doing a top turn. We just place the hand and we let the lady do her thing and turn under the arm. Okay, that's much more friendly for, much more stress on the lady's shoulders doing it that way. So let's lead into the rock, into the basic with a turn out of the arm and a nice lead out after the rock step and we'll just stop there. Five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, back step and stop there. Okay, the left hand for the guy has now done its job. The right hand of the lady is up and we just allow the lady, as the hand's gone up, the lady has pointed the foot in the direction that she's turning, which is good. We're still trying to work out why that foot's connected to the hand, but it usually points in the direction it's turned. So now the lady just pivots out under the hand and we just lower the hand. And then we just draw that hand back over the lady's head and back to open position. Alright, so let's just try that once using all those tips. Five, six, seven, eight, or one. The stronger lead on the back step and out we go. One, two, back step and return to back step. And you notice through the tape, whenever we came into a closed hold, that we always led with a slow count. To back step or the count to the side where the guy leads to the left, the ladies are right. Close to hold, we generally always lead that way. By the time we get to open position, we want to lead from a back step because we don't teach any moves where we might go one, two back step. We always teach from a back step. Now this is important to work on your connection here. When you're standing in open position with your partner, just keep your feet together, stand straight upright, and there's not a lot of connection here, but if you just bring your right foot back or your left foot forward there guys and the lady puts her right foot forward and then just melt into the floor a little bit or just relax those knees you get a little bit of tension happening with the left and right hand and that's connecting with your partner now 